Uh, Toby, a uh, little question. Following the tragic death of John Smith, two members of the Labour Party, both MPs, suddenly found themselves in the forefront. They had money, we think, in excess of 1.5, maybe 1.8 billion pounds. They had organisation, they moved in and took over. They created what has been called New Labour and what we now call a mess. Could you tell us how we should stop it happening again and where you think the funding came from to put these people into office? Well, I'll try and answer that. After we lost a couple of elections, three men, Blair, Brown and Mandelson, got together and they said we will never win another election unless we accept Mrs. Thatcher's economic policy. And when Mrs. Thatcher was asked her greatest achievement, she said New Labour. <laughs> and so that was how I got elected. And it is amazing, the press gave fantastic support to Blair because he was doing what they wanted. And in 1997, which was the last election I fought as a candidate, we won for two contradictory reasons. People wanted to change and the British establishment didn't want to change. And those two groups gave Blair the majority. And now we've come to the point, really, I don't know the personal about it, that the policies that we're following are not in the interests of the people we represent. It's as simple as that. I will always talk about a new leadership election. They're the rubbish who want a new policy. And if you put it that way, people would listen. <laughs> people, people don't want the war. They don't want privatisation, their schools and hospitals privatised. They don't want pensioners living on a mean space, which is what's happened. They don't want students saddled with a bloody great debt. They want civil liberties and trade union rights, and they're not getting it. And so I think those are the questions. I want a new policy, not a new leader. Because I hope everywhere well, if there was a leadership election, the media would have an absolute, well, it would be a fiesta for them. They'd discuss <coughs> the candidates and so on, and they wouldn't discuss politics for a month. So I think we should campaign for that. But don't be too pessimistic. For the first time in my life, the public is to the left of what's called a Labour government. <laughs> and I just, I just feel lonely going round. I say what I said tonight, and people say, good on you, So I think there's a big majority there, but um, um, I'm afraid the present government is trying to follow the Thatcher policy at the moment when the Thatcher policy is completely collapsed. Because you can't go on borrowing and spending, and just isn't an option open. And I think that's what we should do.